We still have to find a way to heal the land, even though the dragon is dead. We've got the magic orb, and we've got that weird little hand brew. But that apparently is not enough. Maybe with Rosella's help, she can uh, take us in further down into the cave works. And maybe there's something interesting there that perhaps she can help solve the problem. You think she would lead the way back? I feel like you don't know where you're going. Well, I found my way here. And yes, that is actually King's Quest IV. That's Rosella's adventure. Cool. People are currently working on a remake for it, but I don't know if it's finished yet or not. We could play the original. You know, why not? We'll get to it later, too. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like this is the way to go. So, I don't suppose you know how to cross chasms. Nothing more to say. Um, do. What do we do? I want to heal the land? Maybe we're just supposed to leave. Walkway twists and turns as it winds to the top. Uh, perhaps they've seen too much use over the years. Can you just fall off? Whee! Bye, Rosella! Whoops. Oh, no, happy music. Alright, maybe we're not supposed to do anything special here. Maybe we're just supposed to walk out of here. We went up there, we killed the dragon. We weren't just supposed to walk on back to the Daventry and be like, Hey, the dragon's dead! I got this orb thingy. Yeah, what do you want to do with it, folks? Well, the fire is gone. Hello, milady. I... Milady, you're free! Could it be to do with the sudden storm I beheld atop Cloud Mountain? Probably. Indeed it was. I had this noble man to thank for rescuing me. Oh, yeah. Incredible. And to think that the dragon is dead and gone after all this time. He is dead and gone, right? Completely. Amazing. Noble sir, whom do I in all of Devontree thank for this miracle? Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Good sir, I am Prince Alexander of Devontree. Gives you a thoroughly mystified look. Then gradually again begin a grin begins to spread his old wrinkled face. The grin becomes a great smile, and soon the gnome is overcome with joy. Yay! Hooray! Wonderful, sensational, marvelous news. He's crossing a rainbow. Yes, it is you, isn't it? I knew it. From the moment I saw you, I just knew it. Why did you just ask? Shh. I must run to the castle and let everybody know the dragon is dead and Prince Alexander has returned. Take us with you. Whee! The mom's totally hop on the rainbow bridge. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, the land still seems pretty screwed up, I gotta say. Mm -hmm. Put it on the warm side. Well, let's try to avoid catching on fire while we walk through our poison home. La 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 I don't know, maybe it will. Eh, I don't want to leave your sister behind. Alright, careful, careful. Oh! Go! Oh, apparently it's alright. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. You can walk the fire. Yep. He is a god. I'm just putting out there, the ground up and it doesn't look stable. No, it does not! 
The rug feels uneven beneath your feet. Well, what do we do to fix that? We, uh... Well, we can't use that now that we have our sister here. Sleeping potion... Uh, I don't know. Maybe we're supposed to... Oh, well. I'm guessing that's not the one we're supposed to step on, huh? Yeah. Falling on all fours is a little help. Okay, it looks like we found the right one. And so did she. Alright, I guess we go this way. Alright. Uh oh, that's bad. The man stands alone in the gloom clearing. He wears a simple hooded garment and pays you little attention. Sister Rosella is looking a little worse for wear. She keeps a great face as she gazes at you gratefully. How gratefully? Hmm, what's your sister? Okay. Black flute, magic man, magic hands. Okay. By far, this clearing makes you feel the most unsettled. There's the twisted trees snatching at the light or the memory of a past evil you cannot be certain. Well, let's be nice and go up and talk to the guy. Hello? Yeah, I'm sure this will turn out well. Hello? Are you alright? I am as I am. Who are you? One who remembers many things. My wisdom once served the king. This is your home, then. It is. I called it that once before yours had meaning. It has hidden something from me. Can I help you find it? Not as you are, my would-be sire. You know me? I know many things. The now, then, and every age in between. The reason for days and why the stars are restless. The forces that work their will on this world. The trivial manner of your arrival. But how could you... Leave me. My time wanes with your wasteful banner. Banner. Don't you want to talk? Alright, you want a knife? You want a... You want a magic orb? Alright, fine, whatever, I'm getting out of here. Let me talk to the father. What about the king? Eh, probably won't do anything. The mighty has fallen. Rocks it prominently in this clearing. It'll take one mightier to lift it. Alright, let's go this way then. Gotta say, the castle definitely seems to have seen better days. Not that we've ever seen it before. Come on, Rosella! Let's go! Should we go into the gates? Or just walk right past them? Okay. Let's walk past them and see what's over here. Ah, oh, the bridge is broken. Never mind. Oh, okay. Go over this way, Rosella. Time to go back in the castle. Oh, hey, we have 200 points now. I wonder where the last ten will come from. Hopefully the sixth gem. <laughs> mm -hmm. Walking through the ruined castle, la 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 la. Mommy! Rosella! Aw, hugs. The royal weaver told us of your rescue. I could scarcely believe it. And this? It's Prince Alexander of Daventry. Son? Yes, Mother. Ugh. My heart is ached with longing for this day. Your absence has been a terrible burden for us all. Magic Mirror. Come, your father awaits us. But the magic mirror! Doesn't anyone notice the magic mirror? It's glowing! What are you doing? 
Maybe I was supposed to be symbolizing. And, oh, it's a little about symbolism. Hey, oh, green orb, what is it doing? Whoa! Holy crap! I know, it's like Dragon Ball Z all over again. A green orb of life is flying through the sky. And eventually it'll go somewhere. <laughs> Take that flame. <laughs> it's putting out all the forest fires. Happy orb. It's healing the land with its laser beams. I hope nobody has epilepsy watching this. Yeah. If anyone goes into an epileptic fit, we claim no responsibility for that. Sorry, send all, know. Send all lawsuits to AGDI. Uh, ah. I gotta say, the land looks a little bit better, doesn't it? Thanks to the Zappy Zappy Gem. That's right. Oh, it's still going. It's not done. It's on a mission. Maybe they should have called this game Orbs Quest 3. Mm -hmm. You just control this little green orb and you go around the Zappy Lake and it makes some water. Hey, there's some water. Hey, it made water. Oh, but it's not done now. I'm sure there would probably be really inspiring music playing if we had the music turned up. Probably. At least one would hope so. Whoa, no, now it's definitely kicking it up a notch. Look at the rate those clouds are going by. You're getting dizzy? <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this Abby Orb oh, anymore. Oh, it's just going everywhere. Oh my gosh, it's flying up in the air. Does that mean it's gone? No, it's falling down now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. Kaboom! Flowers! I remember that, med Where? that meadow. Damn! We need an orb like that to clean our apartment. No, that'd be awesome. Yeah, it would. Just make sure you wear sunglasses. Mm hmm. So ends the first at last. Oh, there Rosella said. Oh, I didn't realize that, sure. Mm hmm. Rosella, are you alright? As good as can be. Hugs. Father, you look. As one who is worried more than any thought possible, for longer than most thought him capable, do not concern yourself. Is this... Yes, Father. Hugs. Ah. I hadn't dared hope for this moment. Why does your crown glow? I don't... Wait, the father wanted the crown to find the item. This must be it. That old thing? Who is the father? It doesn't matter. I'm pretty sure it does matter. Yeah, maybe share a little here, Graham. Mm hmm Today his search ends. Perhaps that will end his cor curse. Perhaps the second will not come to pass. Yes, perhaps. Let us adjourn to the throne room. Or perhaps he'll be super angry. Yeah. My item, no! I have traveled many roads, some joyful, others dark. They have led me far and wide through all manner of danger. Yet they always brought me home to Daventry. Your road, Alexander, has led you from us. For the longest time we lost all hope of seeing you again. But the road, it seems, saw fit to return you as well. What is that? I don't know. That's it. Was his old adventuring hat, isn't it? I think it is. No, oh, I can't get you a fresh shirt, but he can get you an adventuring hat. Yeah, we're still in our rags. Come on, we're the freaking prince here. Mm-hmm. 
Along every step of my journeys I have worn this, my adventurer's hat, a symbol of my zeal and youth. It is right that it should now pass to younger blood. Receive it and know the man who was your father. May it lead you to fortune and great adventure as much as this world will share. To your futures! Yay! And he throws the hat. But who catches it? Hmm. The end. Dun 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 dun! Yay! Hooray! Alright, everybody, that was. AGBI's remake of King's Quest 3. Awesome. Oh, based upon the original work by Roberta Williams. Is that electrical or no? I think it's electrical. Mm -hmm. And this is all the voice talent that we would have heard if we actually had the voice activated. But whatever. Either way, fun little adventure game. We certainly enjoyed it. Some of the solutions to the puzzles seemed uh, oddly narrow. Yeah. Especially on the pirate ship, but, uh, oh. yeah, what can you do, though? Either way, it was definitely a great game all around, in terms of how it was made and how it was redone. So I'm really not complaining. There were just a few little bugs. Every game has stuff like that. Other than that, uh, yeah, it was good. Oh, uh, hmm. So I guess we'll be doing uh, King's Quest Four eventually. Yeah, well, hey, look, there's the bard. It's the bard. I wonder if he's any good now. Yeah, be yeah so we probably won't get to hear whether he's any good. But whatever. Oh, I'm sure he's fantastic. Uh huh. So beyond that, um, hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't think that the remakes that people are working on for King's Quest IV have yet been finished. So, if uh, within a reasonable time frame those uh, remakes of uh, King's Quest IV is not actually done, then I think that we'll just play the original King's Quest IV, which is still a good game. It's just not going to look nearly as pretty as all the remakes we just play. That's okay. Yeah, I mean, I really don't think that's a problem. I don't mind some old school graphics. Mm -hmm. Although I do think that we're going to need a, probably a, a walkthrough to that one. Just because some of the solutions to the, the older versions of the, like the original Sierra versions of the King's Quest games, at least the fourth one especially, were really obscure and weird. Like you wouldn't even think to do some of these puzzles. I think they actually, part of them actually require you to cheat or metagame in some way in order to actually solve it. What can you do? Ha ha, they're actually locking their door now. Damn right, bears. Yeah, smart. Uh-huh, you think they would have figured that out a bit sooner after yeah. the fifth or sixth time their porridge had been stolen. I don't think it took five. Oh, yeah. it was a lot. Yeah. Oh, poor old Medusa gets to sit in a, as a statue back in her little cave. Around. With all the other people she victimized. That's what you get for turning people to stone, you jerk. Oh, and there's Manenin's old house. Chickens are gone. Chickens. Oh, yep, yeah, there's the kitty cat. I wonder if that means that if Manenin has been turned into a cat forever, whether he's just going to live out the life of a cat and then die. Like in ten or fifteen years. Yeah, but if the last Gwydion was killed, then it had to have been at least one before that. So the other cat had been around for like thirty-six years. Hmm, that's a good point. Yeah. And here's a list of all the voice actors again. And there's probably some sort of dramatic music that probably would be playing right now. But again, we turned that off because otherwise you wouldn't Do be able to hear our sing commentary. Sing some dramatic music. Sing some dramatic music, yeah. huh? What song? Whatever. Uh. And I, <laughs> I will always love you. Oh, that was just bad. Yeah. See, that's why you don't ask me to do that kind of thing. Because <laughs> badness happens. <laughs> I know you could do better than that. What? Mm -hmm. I wasn't trying to hold a pitch, you know. Yeah, I know. That takes uh, practice and skill and effort. Nobody wants to do that. Well, at least I don't, in terms <laughs> of singing, anyway. 
Thanks for playing! Thanks for making a game! Indeed. Yes. It's goodbye, Ludor. Hello, Daventry. It did seem like towards the end of the game, like once you got to the Yeti and everything afterwards, a lot of it was just walking around enjoying the scenery. Uh oh. Uh oh, I bet the father's pissed. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, he's of just gonna remake he can. it. He just, like, gave him everything he needed. Mm -hmm. Locked it away somewhere. Hey, is that teeth? I think he's smiling. No, those are definitely angry eyes. Yeah. Angry eyes that are glowing and clenched teeth. Yeah, I'm gonna say that the father is pissed. Mm. And to think he was looking for the item too. Oh. Congratulations, you finished the game with 2 hours, 29 minutes, and 35 seconds on the game clock. We've also accumulated 200 points out of a possible of 210. So we didn't get a perfect score, but we rarely do. What did we miss points from? Whatever. Uh, I have no idea. I Again, I only consulted a walkthrough when uh, we were absolutely stuck with something. Yeah, that whole pirate ship sleeping potion in that one specific location. <laughs> yeah, and uh, having to examine the map. I thought we had done that, but whatever. Yeah. Either way... Fun game, accumulated 200 points. Based on your playing style, you've earned the following secret awards. Ooh, Whoa. secret. Let's see, we learned the uh, Molasses Award, the Neat Freak Award, and the Stockholm Award. Apparently there's also Goldilocks, Doolittle, Legend of More, Mr. Bigglesworth, Infamous, Roger Wilco, Klutz, Marathon, Shortcut, Pacifist, Wallflower, Insomniac, Gluttony, Grudge, Scatterbrain, Rise and Shine, Problem Child, Lightweight, Sloth, Underachiever, Henry the Hermit, Blue Hedgehog, Dagnabbit, Perfectionist, and Consolation. Interesting. Okay. Well, uh, there's, I guess, the achievements. I guess they even put that in this game, too. Alrighty. Well... Hope everyone enjoyed the LP. See you next time. Yep, see you in King's Quest 4 and whatever version we decide to play. Alrighty, see ya. Bye. Bye. Alrighty.